Hi, I'm, hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm taking a look at Overwatch running on Intel UHD 620 graphics with the KB Lake Refresh Core i5 8250U. As you can see here, we're running at 1366 by 768 uh, on the low detail with a 70% render scale, which brings the actual rendering resolution down, uh, I think, a bit under, sort of, I think it's about 600p roughly, and then it's scaling up. To, uh, to fill the screen. Uh, now this is done so that you can keep all the UI elements nice and smooth uh, while reducing the quality of the actual 3D elements of the screen. Um, and I have to say it was a, not a bad experience. Um, the performance from memory is a reasonable amount improved versus what I experienced with HD 620. It's possible this is just down to driver optimizations because the graphics are very similar between the two. Um, but as we can see, going through this uh, this gameplay, just playing against AI online with other players, um, I'm generally seeing frame rates in the sort of 40 to 60 frame per second mark. Um, if we were locking this to 30 frames per second as the game did by default, then we would actually be getting pretty smooth, pretty consistent frame rates. Um, I wouldn't expect to be seeing any real dips in that. As it is, um, I chose just to unlock it and unlimit it just to see what frame rates we were going to get. But I was able to play through this uh, this AI match pretty easily. Um, it was having good fun with it. And um, yeah, so if you're looking at playing on Overwatch on an Intel UHD 620 equipped laptop, okay, you're going to have to sacrifice some detail and resolution, but it's a good, fun, playable experience. I hope you found this video useful and um, be sure to check out the other videos on my channel for more Overwatch and Intel UHD 620 tests. Let me know in the comments below what you would like to see tested in the future and hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos as we post them. Thanks for watching. Come on.